Hello. Not made a video for a while, so I thought I'd uh, document the fuck up. Um, there it is. Now anyone who can see this, which I've put on the screen a bit better, will understand immediately why it went wrong. Have a look. So I was routing out the neck pocket. The bearing, not being secured by the collar, decided to ride up as it was spinning. Over the top of the template and zoom, zoom, into the side. Which is joyful. <laughs> uh, I was hoping to get this one ready for the end of the month. We have a neck. Because I wanted to take a left-handed guitar with me to the Kempton Guitar Show in London. So I've got some ideas about how to uh, recover somewhat from this. I could put some sort of decorative darker wood ring around the neck pocket and then make the neck pocket again. But that kind of feels a bit hacky to me. That was idea number one. Idea number two would be to make a wider neck pocket. And I've never made a seven string neck before, or guitar. So I could take that opportunity to do that. Now, obviously people are screaming at me at the moment going, well, you've got six holes here and hopefully six matching holes on the back. And you can actually get ferrule plates with seven holes in. So I would uh, just route across this I'd work it out. Anyway, so that was the seven string idea. However, I'd have to make another neck before the end of the month doing this part time. So that's maybe a no no. My next thought. Tape residue. Anyway, my next thought was I would just skim the entire top off. I'd need to replace it with an 8mm top to cover up this boo boo. But to cover up. I mean, I could expose the bevel part way through, but you're not focusing. Uh, but I'd need a 12 mil top to account for that. So that's my really quick video because I haven't made one in ages. What would you do? Any of those ideas or something else entirely? I'm probably going to order another body blank just to kind of do that, <laughs> just in case. Anyway, leave me a comment. Let me know how much of an idiot I am for assembling a router a bit incorrectly, and goodbye.